Hamilton's Aviation Technology Center with Mike Garrick, the director. Good morning, Good morning. again. We've had so much fun over the past couple of weeks in the last two segments. One of the things I think people are nervous about, they're in a plane. It's maybe an older plane. They sure. say, well, you know, are they, are they, are they going to wait until a piece breaks or wears out? And your answer is? Absolutely not. Because? So, because every airplane has to be taken apart and inspected every year, no matter how big or like how Like a race small. car. Absolutely. Race cars are just airplanes that don't fly. They yeah, stay and on some the of the same engineers. Absolutely. So a lot of professional race mechanics are airplane technicians. What's in your hand, sir? So what we've got is a gear out of an engine. And one of the processes that we do uh, as part of preventing the maintenance is we'll actually uh, do a process called magnafluxing uh, or NDT, non-destructive testing, and Ed's going to... Can I hand this to Absolutely. So Ed's going to go behind the curtain and tell us what Ed's going to do behind the curtain. Sure. So Ed's going to magnetize the part, and uh, it has to be very dark inside. So Ed's going to magnetize the part, and then he's going to pour a liquid over the top that has very fine metal particles that glow in the dark and he's going to pour those particles over the grit gear and if there's any crack in there at all the magnetism is going to change the way the steel reacts to those metal particles and it's going to glow in the dark so it would show a fracture or whatever that was potentially dangerous if it occurred during the flight absolutely right. we can see a crack as small as a human hair is there ever a point where a part doesn't show any stress but it's just old enough that you're not you're going to replace it there are times and so yeah. we have life cycle uh, dated parts yes. so yes. depend and helicopters have a lot of these as well but uh, big airplanes helicopters certain components that are very very critical to flight we'll only use them so many hours uh, that we know we've got a safety factor built in next segment what are we going to do Next segment, we're going to boroscope the inside of a turbine engine. I don't know what that means, but we're going to do that in the next hour. Stay with us.